Zeker officially launched their updated 001 premium shooting brake. The 2026 model features major upgrades to its electrical architecture, stupid fast charging speed, and super smart driving technology, along with a host of other very nice refinements. Let's take a look at what is one of my favorite looking NEVs. I said I love the way this new energy vehicle looks, so I should be satisfied that they didn't change much. But, you know, actually, I think they could have done more. Other Zika models have taken on a more prominent black mask across the front, like the 007. The 001 has always had a smaller rendition of that, and it gets revised slightly, as does the front and rear. They get a little work done, but nothing major. The revised taillights now include a blue indicator light. That's becoming a common feature to let human drivers know that your EV is driving itself. With that lead in, let's talk about the smart driving updates. Oof, I'm going to butcher this name. Uh, Chin Li Ho Han is the name that the parent company Geely has given to its smart driving technology. And there are five different levels. All Zeker 001s will get their H7 version, which is powered by a 700 tops or 700 trillion, 700 tera operations per second. Connecting the dots, there's a H9 with 900 top systems in the works, but the 700 is more processing than BYD offers at its highest level, and it comes from an NVIDIA Drive Thor U chip. The sensor suite integrates 31 sensors, including a LiDAR, right where you would expect it in that trendy bump at the top of the windshield. They said that earlier 001 models with a LiDAR sensors can be retrofitted to upgrade to the H7 computer, but details would be provided later. The H7 system, of course, will do level two plus highway assisted driving, plus plus urban driving, and also smart automated parking. You know, smart parking, I think, is getting overlooked in the U.S. It seems relatively low risk since it vehicles driving slowly. But, you know, I guess our industry is more focused on putting Uber drivers out of work with robo taxis. Now to the electrifying news. Dad, Dad joke. joke. An all new 900 volt electrical architecture replaces the, um, <clears throat> Um, antiquated 800 volt system. This allows for faster charging and increased efficiency, all focused around two very special battery options. The 95 kilowatt hour battery variant using what they call their golden brick battery. It supports up to 12 C charging, enabling 10 to 80% recharge in just seven minutes. This battery is actually designed by Zeker, and it gets its name from the gold semi-transparent film that they wrap the stack cells with. Their chemistry is lithium iron phosphate, so a direct competitor is BYD's Han L with LFP batteries and their Super E platform. Both are megawatt charging vehicles with the new Zeker 001 claiming it can peak at 1.32 megawatts, adding 2.4 kilometers or one and a half miles of range per second. Gotcha! Zeker, like other EV makers in China, make claims using their own charging hardware, although I'm willing to guess that it charges really, really fast on anyone's high powered equipment. The other available battery is a larger 103 kilowatt hour pack using Cattle's Qi Lin cells. Those are NMC or ternary chemistry. They support only 6C charging, so that 10 to 80% recharge of a slightly larger battery will take you an extra whopping three minutes. Understanding the Zeker 001 lineup, the Max version comes in two flavors for the same price. If you want the faster charging golden brick LFP battery, it gets less range since it has fewer kilowatt hours, but it's less expensive battery, so they toss in all-wheel drive for free. If you want the larger pack, you get longer range, excellent but not megawatt charging, and it's rear-wheel drive only, so it's the slowest 0-62 to 62 at 5 seconds, but you know that's not really slow. The dual-motor all-wheel drive version now produces a combined 912 horsepower or 680 kilowatts and you can accelerate from 0 to 62 miles an hour in a blazing 
2.83 seconds. That's a full second faster and 375 more horsepower than the previous all-wheel drive model. I should note that this is not the FR model, not the ultra high performance 001 FR currently available in limited numbers. And I'm not sure what to think about this. Zeker could be planning a separate reveal for the FR, announcing even more stupid fast levels of acceleration. But I will note that the carbon fiber accents from the FR can be added to the new 001 Ultra. I don't know that this means they're gonna go away from their future road model. I hope not, and I doubt it, but it's missing from this reveal. So the Zeker 001 is powerful, but it also claims some impressive efficiency numbers to turn those kilowatt hours into kilometers. For an EV this powerful and with all wheel drive, that doesn't look like a jelly bean. Yeah, that's really efficient. All wheel drive models get Zeker Track, an AI assistant to help you learn to drift your powerful new energy vehicle. You know, what could possibly go wrong? All models come with electromagnetic adaptive dampening and Zeker's smart magic carpet control system for a superior ride. Plus the Ultra version gets a closed dual chamber air suspension. The interior has been substantially redesigned under the Starry Sky Concert Hall concept. What is a large panoramic roof during the day is capable of projecting shimmering stars at night. It's embedded with 500 light units, allowing you to display different constellation patterns controlled by a new 8-inch rear touchscreen. The concert hall comes from a high-fidelity 29-speaker Zeker Sound Max setup with 4,680 watts of output. Hang on, that can't be right. No, no, that's right, 4,680 watts. I just finished telling you how efficiently this car uses energy, you know, but the audio system just blows all that saved energy out the windows. The central screen is an updated 16 inch 3.5K display, up from 15 inches and 2.5K. It's complemented by a 13 inch digital instrument panel and a massive 39 inch augmented reality heads up display. The seats too get a luxurious overhaul, adding an enhanced massaging functions. The seats now have 20 massage pressure points. The rear seats now offer a maximum recline of 125 degrees and they're equipped with power leg rests and foot rests. So in summary, the new Zeker 001 looks pretty much the same on the outside, but gets a higher voltage, faster charging, more powerful, smarter AI powered, yeah, of course, technology stack under that surface, plus a slew of interior upgrades make you feel comfortable with your purchase decision. Now, just tell me there's still gonna be an FR model and I'll be happy too.